that linked to this animal on the big television box, right? If you can guess what the animal is, yeah. I will admit all children are amazing. Yes, if is. they get it wrong, yeah. they stink. Game on. Press play. Kids, what dangerous animal did I find? Do you know what they smell like? 
know when you went to see a bin bag and there's juice in the bottom of the bin? Yeah. That's what the smell like. You smell like bin juice. They're not bin juice. Apologise. What is it then? What's the smell? That is the smell of Stephen. It's the... Smell it. It smells like shit. Smell it. Do me a favour. Go and find him. We need him for the end. Right, I'll see you in a minute. Yeah. Boys and girls, I'm sorry she called you smell it. Yeah. Here's what we're going to do. Before we go, we've got to have a certain minute or that in the face. <laughs> yeah, boys and girls, before we go, we're going to talk about one final animal. Two years ago, before all this crazy stuff happened, we were contacted by this incredible charity that knew that we talked about animals every day and wondered if we would include the animal they set their charity up for in our show. It was a no-brainer because one, the animal is amazing, and two, it really does need our help. You see, this animal we're about to talk about is going to be extinct for the wild in the next 10 years, which means by the time these amazing kids at the front become grown ups, this animal is gone because of the way we live, and the only way we'll be able to see it is in a zoo. What makes that even harder to understand is that this animal has recently just been voted in the top five most loved animals on the planet. It makes no sense whatsoever. Please take a look at the screen. This is the animal we're talking about. Ladies and gentlemen, the charity is this one, the Orangutan Project. They are right at the forefront of doing their best to save this animal from extinction and they're struggling. They're struggling to help animals like the one on the screen now. Her name is Poppy. This is the one we've adopted and hopefully one day she'll be released back into the wild when it's safe to do so. Please take a look at the screen to find out more about this amazing charity and more importantly, this most incredible animal. This charity does everything it can to save the orangutan.
some scissors and have to get out of here. Anyway, speaking of the ranks of boys, yeah. we do have our merchandise still along there. We've got General John over there, away. There he is, the boys, the boys, the boys. We've got the boys over there now, and at the end of the show, some of the proceeds do go towards that amazing charity. Now, we are the animal guys with the Z on the end. We're on all social media platforms, we're on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, and our website, www.theanimalguys.com. We can pick up tickets for our UK tour, we've got coming up this year and next year. Also, if you've got any questions about any animal in the whole wide world, Feel free to drop us a message because I am our resident animal expert. No, he's not. He doesn't even have the password to Facebook. He can't get back to you. Yeah, right there. No, you don't. You've got us banned for three weeks. Hey, looking for love. That is not the platform. What I usually for. Stephen, we need to go. Hey. You're going to have to do. Oh, don't do this. Come on, they gave us a simple instruction. You're not a three year old. So move. 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 I don't mean move, I mean move away from the box, please! All the other doors on the back is a stupid box. The box takes the box out. What's the worst thing that could happen? Honestly, you dirty yeah. kid! Ah! Stephen! Move! Fell off! Move! Ah! Oh, how dare you! Wanna do the dirty dancing? No, I don't wanna do the dirty dancing thing. Ah. Move over there! Like this? No, I don't like that. What is that? Oh. Is that a Liverpool FC tattoo? Yeah, it is! Get it off! Oh. Oh. Two on there. Like what? Chelsea. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on, I'm going to support Newcastle. I'm just waiting a few years yeah. first. Yeah. Hey, listen, I'll fix the box. Tell them about YouTube. I can do that. Honestly, you're like, I can do that. Hey, sir, it's time for you to show me something. No! No! Oh, come on! It was all right for him, but the kids have had a top gear. They can't look at this. Seriously, put the smoke on the top of your towel. Go. It can't be that bad. Why my mum kicked me out? <laughs> they are lovely people, they will be fine. Just turn around. Come on, you got this. Run and roll. Oh, now you like when you sleep. <laughs> okay. I used to be a model for Jack and Love. Be an Earth Freddy Flint Top. What? what? I went over there to fix the box, boom, the top come off, the magic happened. Now there's people with their fingers crossed hoping I'm single. What? I am. But you're gonna have to go back over there, it's still broken. I'm not going back over there. Why? I've already got my jeans on, you know I do the show, you have them. Absolutely not, listen, I'll do the box myself, it's you're fine. Have to... Whoa! You're doing the box. Yes! <laughs> no. <laughs> now I'm ready to bowl in. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're going to see the magic in three, two, one. Boom. Thank you. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. The kid's just put his camera down and went. Sorry. Hold on a second. I'm going to say, we can't end the show looking like this. We love that stuff, Ross. What are you doing, you? Hey! I love stuff, Ross. You know, he worked on this in summer. He was on this. What? He did more of it. Listen. You can laugh at me, but you know what? what? If you squint your eyes and really look, if I shake my head, I look like a rock. I've got a second, I've got a second. If you look like a rock, what do I look like? You, like a pebble. Oh, I ended up funny when I was five. You were hairy when you were five. Hairy when I was three. You were. Hey, hey, come back to me, I've got some overalls. Well, you've got stuff that'll fit me. Because I'm still to me. Oh, Boys, don't you turn off the CCTV backstage, we don't need to see you get changed again. What have you got? Oh no. I've got you some overalls, put them on. What are these? Come on, just put them on, you'll look good in them, I promise. They look stupid, please don't. Come on, put them on, everyone's going to love this. What is that? It's a they fix that with love this. What is yours like that? Mine's like that. Yeah. Come on, let's get out of here. We can't go now. They're gonna love it. They're not gonna love it. Come no. on, no. Stop with me. Let's go. Boys. Come on, Anna. What the fuck? Yes, we know what we're doing. It's bright, it's comfortable. I look good. What? 
You look like it's hate to me. You, you look like David Black from Coronation Street. Sure. Come over there. You can show up, Dale. Oi. Now, ladies and gentlemen, time for us to go. Oh, we said we were going to give away prizes. Let's do that now. So, who would like to win prizes? I love the way all the kids cheered them as if I was talking to you, because I wasn't. The prizes are for the grown ups! Yeah. Then you realise you have bottlings and nothing is for the grown ups. Kids, the prizes are for you! Yeah. Now listen, I'm going to tell you how you get to win all those prizes right now, but before we do, we've got loads of children sat down here and the ones sat in their chairs, and you've all been super well behaved. Adults, can we give them a big round of applause? Thank you very much, kids. Pretty cool, well done. Should have been at school. Yeah. Listen, this is what we're going to do. First of all, we do need to say a massive thank you to all the grown-ups out there uh, for coming in and watching our show. And we get it, when you go to uh, a bonding show, you kind of know what you get. The Skyline Gang are incredible, the Panto is a Panto. And when you watch an animal show, there's certain expectations. First of all, you're not expecting nudity. You're welcome, by the way. But second of all, you are expecting a whole stage full of animals, and we will be no different. Uh, we are in year eight here at Bullets, uh, just signed for year nine, uh, and we always use live animals. We've had birds of prey and giant snakes and spiders and meerkats and all those different things. And we would stand there and tell you how much we love animals, and then at the end of the show, we'd have to pull them in a truck and drive around the country, and truth be told, it didn't make any sense. And we had to get to a point where they didn't work or travel the way we did. And three years ago we sat down as a team and started looking at special effects and weird routines and then we had to ask Botlins if they fancy booking an animal show with no animals and they were super supportive. And here we are, we'll never use live animals again. This is us for now and uh, ladies and gentlemen you have to just watch an animal show. We're not going to use of one single live animal and we hope you all enjoy. Now, you have to cry, you this is what we're going to do. Time to give away the prizes. So, all the children in the room, give us a wave. Let's have a look at where you are. Okay, that's pretty good. Now, kids, be honest. Give me a wave if you are on holiday with the best grown up in the world and you're glad they're your grown up. There you go. That's lovely. Don't let the grown up force them in just around up there. That's good. Now, kids, be honest with me. Give me a wave if that grown up is shouting at you quite a lot on your holiday while you've been here. Yes! Yes! Kids, you have some proper stress. If you're in the skyline, that's all we can hear is them shouting at you. And we don't want them shouting at you. Do you know why they're shouting at you, kids? What? Because you're all really inattentive. <laughs> They've spent a fortune on this holiday, and all you've done since getting out of the car is ask for a pound for the machines. <laughs> Honestly, you can spend two grand in this place, collect 60,000 weird tickets that come out of the machine, you'll still cash them in for an hour. By the time that we then. Now, this is what we're going to do. All the children in the room to win the prizes, just got to put your hands in the air like this. Everyone in the room, let's have a look at you. Now, this is all oh, we go. Now, kids, all you got to do is just wave your hands like this. Make sure you're smiling, though, otherwise it looks like you're a continent. You don't want that. That grown cell. Yeah. There you go, that's good. Now, kids, this is the tough bit, it's the bit you're not going to like. Unfortunately, you can't win the prizes on your own. You're going to need help. Which means the adults you're on holiday with, they've got to be waving as well. Have a look and make sure they do it. There you go, everybody wave your hands. Now, kids, you can't look at that radio, but they're not waving for you now. This is probably the moment you found out they might not love you. Yeah, let's see. Okay, that's good. This is your one. Oh, look, there's a thing. Don't wave yet, yeah, the music hasn't started to look a bit weird and we're up close to the ground. Okay, now, yeah, this is what we're going to do. All you've got to do is wave your hands. We need a red coat. Where's our red coats? Where about the leader here? Oh, yeah, you see one? Where? That's right. Which one is it? Is it the really good one? No, where's the other one? It's a really good one. Horse this, I mean. Tint it. It's going to be you. Which you are holding then? Everyone's on the beat, you sat your legs crossed. Tint it. Come on. You know you probably had a drink, but you've got to do a bit more before you go out. <laughs> now, Tim, this is what we're going to do. You are going to be the captain, you know? You're going to walk around this room. You're looking for the best table in the room. Now, that's the family all stuck together. They're joining in together. They're waving their hands. They're joining in. At the end, you've got to go and stand by that table, wave your hands. That family, they get to come down to our little shop here. And we've got loads of prizes for them. Are we there, John? 
Remember, ladies and gentlemen, if you have more anything for that shot, some of the proceeds do go to the amazing a Reckless Hang project. So thank you very much. I don't know what happens, by the way. Okay, so let's get you at the tables. Good, good, good. Now, if you've got a torch on your phone, get that up now. If you've got a fashion toy you bought from Bottlings, come on, you've spent £800 on it, you might as well get it flashing. Let's have a look, this is good. John, have we got any big glass in there that you can wave? Just feel like asking them for them a lot, let's see that's better. See, that looks good! Okay. Yeah, you know, we've even, look, we've even got Simon down there, he might even film you. He's always lurking around, doesn't even work for Bottlings. <laughs> Just walks around. Okay, that's good. So, give me a big cheer if you are the best family in the room! Stephen, are you ready to sing? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Good. <laughs> Somebody drink the water. Okay, I'm going to switch the microphone. Let's do this one here. Nice comment. Nice. You can do this for a living. It's beautiful. Okay. Right, we're going to find out who is the best family in the room. This is the one we've got. Quick song for all the ladies. Aww. Love Hollywood. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to leave you with a song. Thank you so much for watching. Don't wave yet. I'll tell you when. Before you do start waving, if I could ask you all to take a look at the screen. This is a video I took of Stephen getting out of the shower this morning. Shame, you look good. Right, let's get those arms in the air.